Hey everyone, my name is Alex and I'm here to show you the MyZone MZ3 or the MyZone belt. I have broken down this video into five different parts. What is it and how does it work? The app, performance, who is it for, and is it worth $150? So let's get into it. So this is the MyZone MZ3. Inside the box we have the strap, charging cable, and the actual insert. This is essentially a heart rate tracker. To use it, you clip the insert into the belt, strap it around your chest just below your sternum, and it will automatically turn on beginning your workout. As soon as you hear it beep one time, you know that it is on, and you can connect to your phone through Bluetooth. Three beeps means that it is off. Like I said, this is basically a glorified heart rate tracker. That means this is going to be tracking how fast your heart is beating the entire time you're wearing it. This uses your heart rate to determine how hard you're exercising and about how many calories you're burning. The faster your heart rate, the harder the workout and more calories that you burn. Now that we have covered what it is and how it works, that brings me to the app because without the app, this thing is basically just a meaningless belt that you're wearing around your chest. So like I just said, this connects to your phone through Bluetooth. And what's great is that through the app, you have a live feed of your workout right on your phone for display. On the screen is the percent of your maximum heart rate. This is also shown in different colored zones. Light gray, gray, blue, green, yellow, all the way up to red. Gray zones mean minimal effort, while red means all out effort. The MyZone belt will also be awarding you MyZone effort points, or MEPS. This is essentially a workout score. The longer and harder you work out, the more MEPS that you get. Higher and harder workout zones means more MEPS. In addition, MyZone has a goal for you, 1,300 MEPS every single month. At the end of the workout, and once you take the belt off, you get a workout summary. This shows the workout duration, calories burned, full graph and pie chart breaking down those effort zones, and automatic sharing to the social media aspect of this app. With the social media aspect of this and the maps I just talked about, MyZone awards you a MyZone status for achieving 1,300 maps in a month. For every month that you hit 1,300 maps, you work towards a higher status. This is ranked in medals going from iron, bronze, silver, gold, platinum, all the way up to diamond. But if you miss a month, you drop down a status. This creates almost a competition aspect with your friends. Your friends can see how many maps you earn in each workout and your overall MyZone status. But if you don't want to share those things, you don't have to. So I know I touched a lot on the app, and that's because the app really is a huge part of this. Without the app, you basically just have your heart rate, and the app is really good at showing you what all that information means. This now brings me to part three. Let's talk about this thing's performance. First off, charging and battery life. This is charged with a USB cable. This just clips right into the back of it, and it only takes a couple hours. It's really quick. And the battery life on this thing is insane. I use this for about six months for every single one of my workouts on one single charge. As for its accuracy, the company says that this is about 99.4% accurate, which I think is a bit of an overstatement, but with that said, I do feel that this is a lot more accurate than an Apple Watch or a Fitbit. Just the location on your body where this sits just below your sternum is gonna give you a much more accurate reading than anything that you wear on your wrist, like most fitness trackers. I would also quick like to add that this is not a fitness tracker you're going to wear all day. This is something that you're only gonna wear during your workouts. Bluetooth might be a concern for some of you, but what's great is that you don't need to be near your phone in order for this thing to record your workouts. The MyZone belt will still record all that information and store it until you get near your phone again and reconnect. So if you go for a quick run and don't have your phone with you, all of the data will still be there. As soon as you get back by your phone, the information will automatically upload into the app. And you don't have to be just running or lifting weights. This thing is waterproof. So that means you can use it for swimming workouts as well. This belt is rated to be waterproof up to 10 meters or about 33 feet deep. If you do more intense exercises, you might have a little problem with this thing slipping. If you're pretty sweaty and doing a lot of movement, the belt can kind of slip down a bit. I find myself having to pull it up once in a while, but it never really affects my workouts. With that, and if you do need it, a replacement strap is only about 20 bucks. Lastly, this thing will need to be cleaned eventually. I do find that my belt does get a bit smelly after a lot of workouts, but it's nothing extreme and pretty much to be expected. The belt itself is washable. I clean mine by hand every once in a while. So now that we have covered all of that, who is this belt really for? Ultimately, I believe that this fitness tracker really is for anybody. Someone completely new to exercise can get a ton of benefit from this, and so can a fully conditioned athlete. It can be used for all types of exercises, steady state cardio, weightlifting, hit workouts, swimming workouts, you name it. With that said, this does rely solely on your heart rate, and it may be better for cardio-based workouts. I can have a great strength training workout and my arms be exhausted, but I may not have gotten my heart rate up that much. 
that's going to be reflected in the MyZone app with the overall effort, total MEPS earned, and total calories burned. Lastly, I would like to say that this is a great tool for my fellow personal trainers out there and your clients. You get real-time information on exactly how hard your client is working out during your sessions. There's also a great accountability aspect of this because with the social media side, you get to see your clients' workouts on their own. So before we see if it really is worth $150, I wanna add one of the drawbacks that I noticed. I don't like how there's no way to manually start or stop a workout. In the app, you can't end a workout with the belt on. The only way to start and stop a workout is by physically putting the belt on and taking it off. It's really not a huge deal and maybe something will come with future updates, but who really knows? So is this worth $150? I think so. It's a nice tool that gives you some awesome insight on your workouts. The fact that this can be used for all kinds of exercises and by literally anyone with different interests and experience levels is great. And you can usually find one of these on sale and you don't have to pay full price. When I last checked, these were $50 off on the actual MyZone website. So that concludes my review on the MyZone MZ3. Thank you guys so much for watching my review. If you guys are interested in picking up one of these, I've attached an affiliate link in the description below. If you click through there and pick one up, it helps me out a little bit at no extra cost to you. I would also like to say that I am not sponsored by MyZone in any way. Just wanted to do a quick review and give you guys some insight on what I've learned. If you feel that this was helpful, please leave a like and feel free to subscribe for more content like this. Have a great day. I have broken down this video into five different parts. Broken this video down to five different parts. What? Parts. 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 I have broken down this video into five different parts. Fucking Christ! Parts. P A R T S. Not P A R P S. Connect your phone through bleep. Through bleep tooth. Bleep bleep bloop bloop. Parts. 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 Not parps. Parps. Oh. <laughs> Different levels of experience and tips for different types of interests is fing shit! It's great! It's fing great! Parts. 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 I have attached an affiliate link in the Link. Cotton mouth. I have attached. I think we're good. Is that it? Yeah. I think I think that's good.